So long. <laughs> I don't know why. Usually I have no problems with that hallway all at once. <clears throat> this time it took us like fucking ten tries. After Sans complimented us. On not dying. I died literally too fucking so many. Babies. Whatever, it's fun. I don't care. Which way am I going? This way. I sure am. Okay. 
Oh, it's coming up. Yep. Nope! <laughs> I've got to deal with this Fuck thing. that! <clears throat> Behind this door must be the elevator to the king's castle. You're filled with determination. Oh my god, we're almost at the end of the game, Zat! Well... Oh man, it's him. Oh yes! There you are, darling. It's time to have our little showdown. It's time to finally stop the malfunctioning robot. Not! Wow, was this the 90s? Malfunction? Reprogramming? Get real! This was all just a big show. An act. Alphys has been playing you for a fool the whole time. As she watched you on the screen, she grew attached to your adventure. Like a nerd! She desperately wanted to be a part of it. Like a nerd! So she decided to insert herself into your story! She reactivated puzzles. She disabled elevators. She enlisted me to torment you! Also, she could save you from dangers that didn't exist! Also, you would think she's the great person that she's not. And now it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alphys is waiting outside the room. During our battle, she will interrupt. She will pretend to deactivate me, saving you one final time. Finally, she'll be the heroine of your adventure. You'll regard her so highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of these predict this predictable charade. I have no desire to har hu harm humans. Far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? Hey, what's going on? The door just locked itself. Sorry, folks. The old program's been canceled. But we've got a finale that will drive you wild! Real drama, real action, real bloodshed! On our new show, Attack of the Killer Robot! Burn. This is probably what we'll do if things continue in this manner. Yes, I was the one that rearranged the core. I was the one that hired everyone to kill you. That, however, was a short-sighted plan. I guess he did hire Muffin. He pretty, pretty much just said it right there, didn't he? Yeah. Okay, whatever. Uh, mistakes. Mistakes were made. It's fine. You know what would be a hundred times better? Killing you myself! Hey, that's not cool. What's your dream? That would have pea shooter doesn't work on me. Don't you understand what acting is? Attack 30, defense 255, seriously, is when the body's invulnerable. Listen, darling, I've seen you fight. You're weak. If you continue forward, Asgore will take your soul. And with your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity. <coughs> but if I get your soul, I can stop Asgore's plan. I can save humanity from destruction! Then, using your soul, I'll cross through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being! Hundreds, thousands, no millions of humans will watch me! Let's glamour! I'll finally have it all! So what if a few people have to die? That's show business, baby! Uh, I can't see what's going on in there, but... Don't give up, okay? There's one last way to beat Metatod. It's, um, it's... This is a work in progress, so don't judge it too hard. But you know how Metatod always faces forward? That's because there's a switch on his backside. So if you can turn him around, um, and, um, press the switch, he'll be, um, he'll be vulnerable. Well, gotta go! <clears throat> you t 
tell Metaton that there's a mirror behind him. Oh! A mirror! Right, I have to look perfect for our grand finale! I don't see it. Where is it? Did you? Just flip my switch. What are, you, what are we at? Oh, we still got a couple minutes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes. This is how you really know Alfie's designed it. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, my. If you flipped my switch, that could only mean one thing. You're desperate for the premiere of my new body. How rude. Lucky for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. So, as thanks, I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, here we go! The ratings oh, are dropping. You say you aren't gonna get a hit at all. Ratings gradually increase during the tongue's turn. Lights, camera, action! Oh, shit. Okay. Forgot how to do that part. It's okay. Pose. Despite being hurt, pose dramatically. Audience applause. Drama, romance, bloodshed. <laughs> Automatically, the audience of the audience. I'm the idol everyone craves. Shit! Okay, I didn't figure I was gonna survive that one. It's okay. Yeah, we'll next time. Yeah, next time on mid bosses, we fight Metaton for real though. Again. Vengeance. <laughs> Metaton to the electric boogaloo. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, baby. Between well baby. Between episodes, can you grab me a cup of water, please? Yeah, just under the middle. Here. It fucking hurts, actually. <laughs> this is probably why I sell no shit. Oh god, I need to fix. <clears throat> Skip it, actually. It gives us an option. Oh, cool. Yeah. Welcome back to Mid Bosses. Oh, 
Oh no, we have to listen to all that again? <gasps> Wait, no we don't! Seems like you could skip Metaton's monologue by turning him around now! What will you do? Skip. You told Metaton there was something cool behind him. Really? Where? You son of a bitch. Clever. Very clever. Metaton EX makes his premiere! I can't tell whether his switch went to the right or the left. I don't know. I'm the idol everyone craves. Okay. Now oh, that is where I would have died last time. Yeah. Um, actually, let's do this. Starfay! You eat the Starfay, the audience loves the brand. Your HP is maxed out. On brand food plus 300. Smile for the camera. Damn. Ah, you bitch. Violence plus ten. You say you aren't gonna get hit at all. Great, it's gradually increased in this metaphor's turn. Ooh, it's time for a pop quiz. I hope you brought a keyboard. Oh, we did bring a keyboard. Zach, type something for me. This one's an essay question. What do you love most about editing? Metaton. Metaton. Beautiful. Sometimes the fewest words speak the loudest. Um, I there was no zero in there. Eh. Wait, is it because I used shift and A? I have no idea. <clears throat> oh, your essay really showed everyone your heart. Why don't I show you mine? Position, but sure, that counts. Lights, camera, bombs. Things are blowing up. Time for our union regulated break. This is literally free ratings. Happy break time. <laughs> Jesus! Look at him go! Christ! You say you aren't going to eat If he... If he vokes that hard... <laughs> I'll crump with you, sweetie pie! We've grown so distant, darling. How about another heart to heart? Know the one episode of The Simpsons I remember in great detail, but I can never find because I don't know the episode title and because, you know, you ever try and type in a description for an episode and something in Google and you get 500 unrelated fucking things? Yes. The episode of The Simpsons where Mo turns his bar into a gay bar. And he jumps, and at one point he gets into an argument with, uh, <clears throat> Skinner? No. No, um, shit. 
Smithers? Smithers. He gets into an argument with Smithers, who's a regular there at that point. Yeah. He gets into an argument with him, and to distract everyone, he jumps up on the bar and starts voguing. Sing. I fucking remember that vividly, but I can't find the damn episode. Yeah. Oh, there's face. Oh. Yeah, that's my uh, arms. Who names arms with legs like these? I'm still going to win. Uh, I forgot how to do that part. <laughs> Humanity to perish? Or do you just believe in yourself that much? I don't believe in myself. I believe in Alfie, she believes in me. There you go. Since she's a winner. Yep. <laughs> How inspiring. Well done. It's either me or you. But I think we both already know who's going to win. Witness the true power of humanity's star! Oh, leggies! Leg knives. Damn matter your leggies. Yeah, man. Yeah, that was like you out. Ha! You know? Yeah. Then, are you the star? Can you really protect humanity? Whoa! Oh, God! Damn it! Well, you know what? I think that was enough, actually. What, getting hit? Um... Ratings? Ratings. Another time. POSE! Ooh, look at these ratings! This is the most viewers I've ever had. We've reached the viewer Colin Milestone. One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Office. Nope. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? Guess who it is, Zach? Oh. Hi, Metaton. <coughs> God. <coughs> yeah, tell me about it. No, I had like that really weird, like, kind of reverb effect you get. When your votes, when your vocal cords are like a certain grittiness. Oh. I really like watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life vicariously. <coughs> I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode. <coughs> I miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. No, wait, wait! They already hung up. I'll take another caller. Metaton, your show made us so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll watch without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton shaped hole in my Metaton shaped heart. What does that mean? Ah, <laughs> uh, I. I see. Everyone. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters, they only have me. If I left, the underground would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled. So, I think I'll have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong. Perhaps even strong enough to get past Asgore. 
I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. Ha <laughs> ha. It's all for the best, anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is... inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and... Well, I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience. <clears throat> Whew. I did it. I fought Metaton and won. I, I managed to open the lock! Are you two? Oh my god. Metaton! Metaton, are you? Thank God, it's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I would have... I would have... I mean, hey, it's no problem, you know? He's just a robot. If he messed it up, I could always just build another. Why don't you go ahead? There will never be another Metaton. It's out of batteries. Nope. <clears throat> but she doesn't tell you that part. S sorry about that. Let's keep going. Okay. So you're about to meet Asgore, huh? You must be... You must be pretty excited about all that, huh? You'll finally... You'll finally get to go home. Bye, Alfie. Wait! I mean, um, I... I was just going to, um, say goodbye and... Uh, I can't take this anymore. I... am super gay for Undyne. Like, really, really gay. I can't... I can't take how gay I am for Undyne. And then, and then Frisk is like, uh, yeah, I, I fucking know, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too. I, 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 <clears throat> her house was flaming, but not as much as you. <laughs> her house was literally on fire, and you were more flaming than it was. <laughs> <laughs> I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul and a monster soul. If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. You want to repeat that shit you just dropped on me? <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Next time on Big Bosses. Here's the time. Yeah, just about. Alright, next time on Mid Bosses. Next time on Mid Bosses. We'll get off this elevator.